Yo, what's going on my beautiful Baydestrians? Ask and you shall receive. I had a ton of requests to do the Nike Crenshaw Lowrider review, so here it is. First things first, you guys absolutely killed it on the last video as far as the likes went. I asked for 2,000 likes and in the first hour we got 3,000 likes. That is crazy. So I'm going to set the bar a little bit higher on this one. Let's get this video right here to 4,000 likes. Let's see if you guys can do that. I have faith in you. I have faith in you, so make sure to do it. <laughs> Anyways, man let's get right into this review we have a regular reddish orange nike box with the white lettering you guys have seen this box before nothing too crazy but we're gonna start and look at the tag we have an air hirachi run premium quick strike i go with the size 10 in hirachis whenever i wear these they fit a little bit snug so i go a half size up i would definitely recommend to do that if you guys have a wide foot or you just want some extra wiggle room but if you guys like sneakers snug and kind of tight then go true to size but i like a little bit of wiggle room in mine and i have wide feet so i go half size up in these Box price is going to run you $120, and these are on the resale market for about $300-ish I saw on eBay. So I'm glad I was able to cop my pair because that resale is a little bit ridiculous for this right now. But let's get right into these sneakers. Like I said, we have the Nike Air Hirachi Crenshaw Lowriders. Now this was a collaboration between Undefeated and Nike. When I did the unboxing on these things, I was so amazed. From the quality of the suede, to the really nice colorway, to the iridescent shine on this back piece, everything just worked together so well in my opinion. Opinion. And this shoe is very simple like it is what it is you see what you see So I'm not gonna get too in detail with it But this hands down has to be one of my favorite Hirachis to ever release for the uppers They went with a very very soft suede as you guys can see when I put my finger through it It resets the nap and it just changes. It's a very nice suede, very soft A lot of the releases that we see nowadays is just that hard sandpapery suede this one is smooth it's nice i love it i could just do this all day son all day for the tongue area all the way around here they went with like a nylon material very similar to the supreme hat shot to supreme shot to the hype beast one time and they went with blue laces of course to match the rest of the color on the uppers quick side note the inspiration for the blue color comes from crenshaw high i believe one of their school colors is blue so that's why they went with this theme nice kicks did a collaboration very similar to this their pair was white on the uppers and it had a blue outsole and I prefer this one a little bit better. Just something about the blue really pops to me. The white felt like it was missing something. And I know it was just the colorway in my opinion. A lot of people were hating on this pair right here. But y'all that are hating on this, you guys are crazy. But it's all good though. I remember when these dropped online, I thought, nah, I'm not going to be able to get them. But I was able to cop a pair. I'm not sure if it was just me or the timing that I had with it. But I feel like these ones, they sat for a little bit, like the first hour. And then by the end of the day, I checked again, boom, sold out. I will leave a link to eBay down below in the description. Just know that all of the prices on there are gonna be resale prices. So if you guys like it and you're willing to dish out that money or you got it like that, then you're good. But I'm just letting you guys know what to expect. Anyways, moving right back into the sneakers. You guys see this iridescent chrome, gold, greenish, purple. Like this thing changes colors in the light. It depends how you look at it. When you're walking, it's always changing. And I know right now we're just looks gold but this is one of those things that you kind of need to see in person like right here it looks green a little bit then it changes to blue this finish is insane and a lot of the low riders that you see in socal have different kind of finishes on their wheels some are gold some are metallic blue metallic purple so i thought that this was a really nice shoe because they're kind of highlighting the car culture down south and for something like a shoe company that represents the sneaker culture to acknowledge another culture such as the car culture i thought that was very sick of them so anyways you guys see it blue midsole white outsole like i said nothing too crazy on this pair where it does get a little bit more interesting is the insole right here it is a blue insole and all it says is Hirachi if I were to change one thing about this sneaker I would change the insole up a little bit I would make maybe an image on the inside maybe a Crenshaw lowrider like the name of the shoe but that's just me comfort wise these Hirachis are very comfortable in my opinion the Nike Hirachi is very similar to the ultra boost like the Nike Hirachi this shoe right here this is Nike's version of the Ultra Boost, in my opinion. That's how I feel. How I feel about Nike is that their stuff looks good, but it's not always comfortable. This shoe right here, to me, it looks good and it's comfortable. So that's why I'm kind of saying that it is kind of like the Ultra Boost, but the Ultra Boost will take it for comfort. Ultra Boost are 10 out of 10. These are a 9 out of 10, so very close in my opinion. Let's get these babies on feet, and if you guys like this video, please hit that like button if you guys haven't, and I'll catch you guys next time. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay. I'm out. Peace. Hollywood, Los Angeles. Hollywood, Los Angeles. Yeah. Hollywood, Los Angeles. Hollywood, Los Angeles. Sunset. <laughs> Steps and ashes. Why do I kill everything I touch?
much Why do blood run so deep? After so long, why it means so much? Shadows of a song, man, it could have been a rap Could have wrapped up, should have said I'm never looking back Took a backpack, packed everything I owned into it Hopped on the train, threw it on the track I guess that's what I do, at least what I do best I beg my part and part from you, girl, you the one that I do bless With this holy water, go roll the on Took a bubble bath with the preacher's daughter, that's holy water, uh Can you imagine magic in the air, the passion when I'm passing L's and hell smoking, laughing, last lap of lust, the love, trunks and wagons, y'all pat the Dutch, I don't buff the dragon Niggas be dragging ass, it don't make shit, and they wonder why it don't make sense Say it's been a while, they wonder where you been, I have been locked up in that basement I was 16 with a mixtape, now I'm 19 with a mixtape, trying to be 21 with a million dollars Like praise the Lord, hallelujah, hallelujah Would you dance with me in the rain? Would you share your empathy? Kill my pain, paint this picture for me. I'll be by ya, mañana when you need me. I'm gon' call ya, call my baby. That's how ya, you the reason. Want on my feet, don't touch the ground. Want on my feet, don't touch the ground.